a nuclear incident. That's how one local doctor is describing his time in ICUs across the region. Early this morning, Dr. Stephen Brown, a virtual care doctor at Mercy Hospital, sent this tweet saying in his 40 years of care, he has not encountered so much death as he did in 12 hours last night. News Force Jenna Ray joins us live outside Mercy Hospital. And Jenna, what's the doctor's response to the thousands of comments on social media? It really went viral in just a matter of hours, Maurice, and I talked to Dr. Brown just a few hours ago. He tells me he sent that tweet after working a grueling shift treating those ICU patients, and he tells me because of HIPAA laws, he can't go into specific detail, but he says at least four of his patients in just the last 12 hours have died because of COVID-19. Now, Dr. Brown has been in this field for more than 40 years, and he's been treating patients recently in Missouri, Oklahoma and Arkansas now for the last year and a half. Brown tells me in the rural communities and all three of these states are getting hit the hardest. He says there's minimal ICU beds. There's a lack of oxygen, ventilators, nurses and even doctors in some locations. Dr. Brown says he's seeing patients come in younger and younger every day and more than 90% of them currently in the ICU are unvaccinated. I had four deaths um, between seven o'clock and 10 o'clock last night. And, you know, and they kept coming, you know, and and then several people who came in who uh, I was pretty sure were not going to make it um, even after I left at seven in the morning and I just checked the roster and, and they're gone. Right now in the St. Louis region, 91% of ICU beds are full. That's according to state data, and that means that that is the highest amount of patients we've seen in ICU beds in the St. Louis region since the start of the pandemic. We're live in West County tonight. Jenna Ray, News 4.